Right guys, it's your boy Alpha. We're back today. We've got um, a Brilliant Stars Elite Trainer Box, which um, I've not opened any Brilliant Stars yet so far, so this is new to me. I think there's quite a few Charizard packs in this, um, Char Charizard packs, I mean Charizard um, cards in this set, and there's some Arceus ones, so looking at um, the screen in front of me, I've got uh, the better cards, there's three Charizards in the top five cards, and there's four Arceus in the top seven cards, so... So if you play Charizard or Arcus cards, you've done well because they're the better cards in the set. Um, just looking on the back, what you get um, in these elite trainer boxes. Um, you get the eight packs, you get dividers, sleeves, dice. Um, you get the rule guides, some energy cards, which looks like they're a bit different than these ones. You get the booklet, which we're, which is good because if you're collecting the set, you get to see where all the cards fall in the set. So... I don't think it's the biggest set ever, so if you like, if you look there, I mean, you can stop it on screen. There's some good V cards, there's Shaman, there's the Rude, there's Charizards at the front as well, which I, and that's, so there might be five Charizards in this set then. Um, so that's good, because we always like a Charizard chase. Mimikyu, that's good, because I like Mimikyu, that's a very good card. Um, that's a V Max. I wonder if there's a Ultra or Full Art one. Zarkius there again. Drampa. Let's have a look. So, shaming for that. Yeah, so you've got two Charizards at the top. And we've got... It's a Luminion. Honkrow, Zamazenta, Flygon, Arceus, Arceus. No, unfortunately, there's not a Mimikyu um, for that, which is, would be nice. Um, another Charizard down there. That's the, um, the best one, apparently. Personally, I think that's the nicest Charizard, which is the second most valuable card. Um... I'd rather have that because that looks really cool. Um, let's have a look further back. We've got all the Glarian birds with Arceus in the um, secret um, rare golds. Now they've brought some new ones, which I don't know what these are classed as, um, with the yellow backgrounds on them. Um, it's got Octillery, Jolteon, Zekrom, Dusk, Dusk Noir, Dedeen, Akrima, Riyadas, um, Houndoom, Arangu, Guru, Eva, Vaporeon, Flareon, Fulton. Yes, oh, so there's some good Mimikyu cards. Yeah, so for me, I, I like Mimikyu cards, so I, I like them, to, you know, I'd rather have these ones. They're very good. Oh, and look at these Urshifu ones, they're nice as well. Something different. Quite a lot of full art. So there's quite a lot of cards in this set. I don't know what the TG ones are, though. TG? I don't know. I don't know what the TG ones are. Um, we'll find out anyway because we're going to get into this. So that's the um, that's that done. Um, we'll open the box. Um, get rid of that. Let's put it on the floor. Um, that's a rule book, like I say, you get with it. Get the dice, the V Star, um, the dice. We've got the dividers. The energies are a bit different in this set. That's the uh, co card. Um, the sleeves of this is so hopefully we've got eight packs in this one like I said when we did a back um, I did a box opening the other week um, there wasn't an S so, um, sorry there wasn't all the packs in there we were actually missing packs which which is very annoying really because that's that's um, obviously the quality check at the um, the factory you know what I mean you, you don't want to be missing cards so what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the Charizard till the end um, we'll start with the shaman. Actually, we'll start with the worst one, I'd say, on the packets, which is Cottoner. So we'll go from right to left. Um, oh, these packs are a bit different to, to open, aren't they? Like I said, these are the first um, Brilliant Stars um, I've opened, so bear with me. Got to be cut really weird as well. Right, so we've got a Dark Energy, got a Clang, got a Cynthia's Ambition, got a Torkoal, got a Snorunt, got a Clink. Oh, we've got a Clang, didn't we? So we've got a Clink Clang. It's crazy. You don't normally get the evolutions in the same pack. So we've got Dedean, got Cub Chew, got a Duskull, got a Snorunt. And go muck as a rare. So our first 
hollow is a snow is a snow run or snow run whichever you want to pronounce it all right so the next pack i don't know how to get into these packs this is a easy way to do it but i'm finding it difficult to break into them and i'm a full-grown adult only just right so next pack so we've got fire energy Got Sharon's Care, got Baytick, Collapse Stadium, Electrobuzz, Chimeco, Gibble, Turtwig, Trapinch, Pachurisu, and Lipad. So far, nothing good yet in pulls. Um, next pack will go for the Shaming Pack. The artwork design of these are pretty um, different to normal. I think it's um, looks pretty cool. Something different. It's code card. What's these cards about? So we've got a V. I don't even know what that. What is this card? So we've got a Ultra Ball, Tropius, Morgrim, Riolu. Starly, Spiritum, Purloin, Milsere, Single Strike Urshifu V, which is a TG18 to TG30 card, which is different, I guess. And we've got a Zamazenta V. So I'm not sure what these cards are, these T C TG ones. So let me have a quick look. I saw there was a different section on here for the, t uh, the trainer gallery ones. Is that what they are? So the class is trainer gallery cards. And the better ones are the Umbreons and Sylveons than the Mimikyus. The Urshifu, what I've just got there, is apparently £7. Which, I suppose it's not too bad. So this booster box were £42.50, so... Not too bad, I guess. A little bit back. Obviously, there might be some value in the Zamazenta as well. But what is the V card? V star about? If anyone knows, comment below because I want to. I want to understand what the V star is about. Right. So we've got a Psychic Energy, got a Weavile, got a Fracture, which has evolved from Axu, got a Cafe Master. Got a bow toy, got the Axew, got the nose pass, got the snow runt, got the clink, got the fracture, which we've got in here twice because it is there, and got boss's orders, which is a hollow rare card, which we take those. I guess that is a pull. It says switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with your active Pokemon. With their active Pokemon, sorry. So I imagine in game that would be pretty cool. So if someone's got like the Pokemon and it's absolutely destroying them, you can just swap one in what's got nothing on it, basically. That's the um, Coca. Like I said, I don't know what this feast staffing is about. Um, so we've got a uh, water energy, got clay doll, got an executor, got hunting gloves, got Shinx, got impidimp, got Golit, got cast form, got chimcha, got torkoal, and got a whimsicott V star. So that's a, a nice pull. That's part of the main set. First V star I've pulled. Looks a decent card. And actually, it looks a very decent cut as well. So we'll take that and the taco, which the nice thing about this is that I've opened five packs and um, no duplicates so far of the good cards. So I guess that's a win. Yeah, these uh, packs are really difficult to open. I'm surprised. Um, I'd like to see a kid have a go at one. It's not easy to get in. 
I don't know if anyone else has found them a bit tougher. So we've got a, uh, I would say yellow energy. We've got electric energy. Got a Gabite. Got a Grotto. Got a Barry. Got a Didine. Cub Chew. Duskull. Got a Farfetch, which I'm not sure if I'm a fan of that picture. It looks like a kid's drawing it, to be honest, but. Okay. Exec that looks all right, execute. Wormadam looks a bit better. It looks more like a photo. And we've got a Magmortar. Wormadam trash. Gotta love it. Right, so now we've got the last two packs, which are the Charizard packs. So can we get anything in the Charizard packs? Card. Right, so we've got Steel Energy, got Double Turbo Energy, got Sindler, got Primplup, Farfetch'd again, Execute again, Grimer, Sneasel, Bidoof, got Escavalier, which is a nice card, I've got an Alcrema. Right, so that's that one. And this is the last pack of the video. So if you if you enjoyed this video and seeing what we get in these uh, elite trainer boxes or anything what we open, just drop it a like and subscribe to the channel. Um, I haven't really got a schedule at the moment. It's just as I'm gonna buy stuff, to be honest. So keep subscribed, you'll get to see when I drop stuff. And we always try and give away the code cards because we're nice like that. So drop it a like. Especially if you get the code cards, make sure you're liking the video because I do appreciate it. And it shows me that some someone is getting the videos, not bots. Um, so we've got a Grass Energy, got a Luxio, got a Pot Helmet, got a Sigalith, got a Piplup, got a Shroomish, got a Purloin, got a Duskull, got a Sneasel, got a Kling Clang, and we've got an Infernape as a Hollow. Which, to be fair, that's pretty. That looks pretty cool. I like. I like that one. I think the hollow is now looking better than ever. To be honest, I think that's a decent hollow. I quite enjoy that. That's nice. Um, obviously the clean clan we need as well. But the free pulls of today today's video. Then we've got a whimsy cop V star, a single strike Urshifu V, and a Zamazenta V. Which I'm sure probably none of them's worth much. That said, like I said, that's worth seven pound. Uh, the Whimsy Cop V Star and the um, and the Zamazen. Uh, I'll try and have a quick scan now to see what they're worth, but I don't think they're worth right much. Yeah, they're not worth much at all because it, it, like I said, I can't find them down the below two pounds, so I'm not really sure where um, they're falling. Yeah, the Whims Cop V Star is like 250, and then the Zamazen is just a V. Vs don't really ever fetch right much. So, yeah, so that's the pause for today. If you've enjoyed that, thanks for watching. Make sure you drop it a like, and I'll see you next time. Oh, also, before I leave, we have got something for next time, which is why you probably want to subscribe to the channel. I'll just get what we've got. So, the next thing we're opening is a full booster box. So if you subscribe to the channel, there's 36 packs, so you might be able to get yourself um, some of the code cards on that. You might be able to see some of the good pulls we get. Well, you will see what, what the pulls are. Hopefully we'll get some good pulls to show you. So, yeah, thanks for watching. See you later, guys.